What's up, everybody? It's me, your boy. We just got to Universal, and we're now about to take a picture with Hello Kitty. Visiting that after. So we're about to do the studio tour. Um, oh, elevator. And we'll let you guys see how that goes. Hello, Steve. Say hi, Aries. And all of those shows have something in common, which is they were on the studio tour. Studio audiences. So uh, that's an anniversary a couple weeks ago of when our founder, Carl Ludley, first invited the public onto this property. Come to our studio, take a look behind the scenes and see exactly what we do here. More than 100 years ago, Carl Ludley came out here to California and he had a dream. He wanted to create an entire city dedicated to movie making and that's exactly what he did. These are sets designed to look like city streets and we can redecorate them to look like whatever city in the world we want depending on our story. Across the courtyard to your right you're looking at Brownstone Street. It's a typical urban residential neighborhood that could be in just about any city in the world. Here's a few of the stars that have walked up and down Brownstone Street over the years. The City Hall building over on your left was the Clock Tower in Back to the Future Parts 1 and 2. It's so looking at We got some of the cars from Back to the Future, Back to the Future Part 2, right next to these Stone Age foot power cars from the Flintstones. So we got the future and the past totally covered. Now, I'm a big fan of the Fast and the Furious movies. I love that we have all these hot rods out here. I got really excited when they brought out that 1941 Willis Coupe. It's a very cool old car. I don't know if it's the real deal though. A lot of these cars are not. Like the tank here at the end of the line, that's actually made out of plywood. So don't take it into battle. It won't protect you. When we're making a movie, all we care about is the picture. We don't need things to actually work. We just need them to look good. So a lot of the cars that you see in movies don't have engines in them at all. We take them to help it show up. We might even add something like milk or paint. But the one thing we don't want to do is run that water too long. Because if you do that, you get flooded. So, uh, Cody, go ahead and shut the water off for us. Cody. be a diver up by that boat. Well, hopefully he knows what's going on. There he is, there he is. Pete! Pete! You see the shark? It looks like it's heading for you. Can you just... Pete, are you trained for this? You gonna be alright? Give me like a thumbs up. Let me know. Pete? Pete? Oh, for Pete's sake. Okay, we're gonna have to call that in. Don't panic, folks. We're perfectly safe here on the tram. We're just gonna pull forward and hang out. Beautiful. Don't just worry about the who's, because here on the back lot, their next door neighbor is kind of a psycho. This is the Bates Motel, where Norman Bates met all of his victims. Up at the top of the hill, you can see the psycho house where Norman lives with his mother. The psycho house is cool. It's built on a 7 8 scale. That means it's slightly smaller than it ought to be. On purpose to film this unbelievable scene. The airplane that crashed the site set was perfect. Jared all went to ride on the mummy. I stayed back so that 
I could watch him because he can't ride the ride. And it's just so difficult to do the child switch here. So I was like, whatever, I'll just not gonna ride it. So I'm here waiting. And so, yeah. It's not gonna be one of those things where we get to the front and they're like, all right, they're gonna go on break. No, they would have told us to <laughs> not stand in line. But we're good. We're gonna go take pictures and then we'll probably play in that water park. It's so hot. Ah! Oh, cool hot. Aries cool off a little bit. Let me cool off a little bit. It, it says it's like 76, but it feels like 100 or maybe 90. There's no wind, so. Okay, we'll keep you guys updated after this. Peace.
have just finished over here. Super silly fun land or whatever it's called. Oh yeah, now we're gonna go to Harry Potter World. Yay. I'm so excited. You're a wizard, Twangy. <laughs> <laughs> We're here. We're <laughs> Oh, let's go get butter beer. Do you see my flowers up there? I'd like for you to give them some water. Point your wand and say Agua Menti. Agua Menti. Yes. <laughs> <No. laughs> <laughs> say Wingardium Leviosa. Wingardium Leviosa. Yes. <laughs> Olivander's wand show. Me and Kua got our wands personally picked. Here's mine. You're just showing the box. You have, you have to take it out. I got paired with a reed wand. I, she didn't tell me what the core was. Kind of disappointed. Kua got paired with a holly. And uh, we're waiting for our friends and family to get off the roller coaster. And Maybe we may ride it too. Where are we? Like next to where? We're right in front of Hogwarts. So I'm gonna open my wand. Sorry, my shoes are off. My feet are so sore. Here it is, guys. My wand. Oh no. Okay. Woo! The Holly wand. I'm a
Plenty more of that came from, baby. Okay, ready? Go ahead. Okay, sure. ready? One, two. There you go. Thank you. <laughs> Hello, guys. I'm back. And I look a mess. My, oh, my camera's gonna die, so I'm gonna make this quick. So we just finished the park, and it was a lot of fun. We're now just chilling. Gonna head back to the hotel and go to sleep.